Google's VO3 is out and it's crazier than you think. You won't believe what I created using VO? Check it out. Mission control. The others are gone. Equipment failure during the dust. Hermes, this is Chen. I copy. I'm here. I'm alive. Sarah Chen, we're coming for you. I created this entire short movie trailer using VO, and that too completely for free. And not just movie trailer, you can use VO for any niche and any project. This is not a paid promotion. I'm just going to share my personal opinion and the right way to use VO3 and that too for free. It's impossible to believe that just a few years ago AI couldn't even make a proper walking video and just check it out now. The quality is absolutely mind-blowing. Listen, if you want to use VO better than others, then don't skip this video because I'm about to show you exactly how you can make your own movie trailers that get millions of views and never get any copyright issues. I've cracked the code on this and I'm going to share everything. This is the future of content creation and you're about to learn how to dominate it before everyone else catches on. So stick around because this is going to change everything for you. VEO is literally the best text-to-video generator I've seen so far. The quality is 10 out of 10, and the accuracy and lip sync are also perfect 10s. It's literally impossible to tell whether it's an actual video shot from a million dollar project or a simple AI video generated from a single prompt. Later in this video, I'll show you how to use it for free, so stick with me. But before your excitement dies down, let me take you straight to the process. Simply search for VEO3 on Google and jump into the first website. You'll see two options, but you want to go with Start in Flow, then click on Create with Flow. Once you land on the interface, simply click New Project. The interface is extremely simple. Just select the Text to Video option, and then you need to paste your prompt here. Now, this is going to be a bit technical, so pay attention. For a quick demonstration, I have this random prompt with me. Let me show you. I'll paste the prompt and hit generate. It takes VEO a few seconds to make the video, just like any normal text-to-video AI tool. If we look at the quality, it's pretty good, but this isn't what I was really talking about. This is just a simple video without any proper animation or dialogues. Here's the thing. To make proper dialogues, you need a specific command, and you also need to tweak some settings. For that purpose, I've created two prompts that will cover everything. All these prompts are arranged in a Google document. You can access these prompts from the prompt channel of my Discord server, I'll leave the link in the description. So first, let's head back to ChatGPT. We'll provide GPT with the first command, which tells it to act like a professional Hollywood-level movie director and give us high-potential copyright-free video ideas in the form of titles to create small movie trailers by ourselves. And trust me, GPT will literally spit out all the high-potential video ideas for creating movie trailers. You already know that movie trailers always rank tons of views, right? After we have the movie trailer ideas, you can just pick one of them. Now comes the main prompt, and this is where it gets interesting. In this prompt, you just need to enter your video topic and the number of total scenes you want in your trailer. There's a big reason behind using this specific prompt. This prompt commands GPT to define the scenes properly, and instead of getting a regular script, you'll get scene descriptions that you can input directly into VEO. But that's not all. This prompt also commands GPT so that each scene includes a specific line stating the dialogue to be spoken. Plus, it tells GPT to specify background audio elements and objects in the scene, like sound effects, machinery, cars, or whatever's in the image. Basically, it crafts a proper storyline for you. Once you have all the prompts ready, let me show you the magic. We'll simply copy-paste the first entire prompt into VEO and make sure to select Text to Video. After that, click on the small settings icon where you can select the number of outputs you want per generation. I suggest going with four because they all cost the same number of tokens anyway. Now here's the most important part, model selection. Before we selected VEO2, which is the older model, and that's why we got basic text to video results, but now you need to select VEO3, which includes all types of audio and lip sync as well. Hit generate, and it will take around two to three minutes for your video to be ready. But remember, VEO3 costs a lot of credits. While the video is processing, let me show you how to get VEO for free. Simply click on your profile logo at the top right corner, then click on Upgrade. It will ask you to subscribe to a plan, but don't worry. Google gives you the first month completely free. You just need to enter your card details to subscribe, and you won't be charged a single cent for the first
first month. If you want to continue, it costs $20 per month. Otherwise, you can cancel your subscription before the trial period ends and you won't be charged at all. Our video is also ready. Simply click on the download icon at the top, select your resolution, and your video will be downloaded. Let me give you a look at this video. So guys, our videos are already completely animated. We just need to put them together in cap cut and add a bunch of transitions, effects, and background music. That's literally it. Once you've imported all the clips into cap cut, simply place them all on the timeline. Make sure to place all the clips in the correct sequence, and that's really all the heavy lifting you need to do. This is probably the easiest and most effortless method to make money online in one of the best niches using one of the most trending AI tools right now. Once all your clips are properly arranged, here's what we do next. Go to Transitions and add a black fade transition between each clip. You know how all movie trailers have that black fade animation? It gives that cinematic feeling we're after, so stick with black fade only, nothing else. After that, head to Effects. In the search bar, look for an effect called Horizontal Open and place this effect at the very beginning of your first clip. Make sure to keep its length around 1.5 seconds. This creates that cinematic opening effect that all these trailers have. Pretty cool, right? Now, head to the end of your timeline and search for another effect called Horizontal Close. Simply drag and drop it onto your last clip and adjust its duration to 1.5 seconds as well. This gives you that professional trailer ending. Next up, head to the Filters tab where you'll see tons of options. Try a few different filters and choose one that matches the overall vibe of your video. Place it on the timeline and stretch it across the entire timeline if needed. You might want to tweak its strength to get it just right. Don't be afraid to experiment a bit. When all this is done, you can download copyright-free background music from YouTube. There are plenty of channels that provide copyright free music you just need to credit them in your videos description and that's all make sure to reduce the music volume so it doesn't overpower your dialogue and that's literally all you have to do mission control the others are gone equipment failure during the dust hermes Chen, I copy. I'm here. I'm alive. Sarah Chen, we're coming for you. ETA 18 hours. Hold tight. I'm going home. Emma, mommy's coming home. No, this can't be right. How many times? I'm losing my mind. This is Sarah Chen, Mars Station Alpha. If anyone ever receives this, know that I tried. That's exactly why I called this niche and this entire method the easiest one out there. Now, as my honest opinion, I'd give VEO a solid 7 out of 10. Here's why. Besides being incredibly powerful and almost perfect, there's one major setback with VEO, and that's the subscription cost. If you want to make 10 to 20 short movies every month that could potentially bring in millions of views, you'll have to purchase Google's premium plan, which costs around $150. I know that's pretty expensive, and honestly, if I were you, I probably would wouldn't buy it either. But for normal use cases, you can go with the basic plan, which costs only around $20. Using that plan, you can make 100 normal text-to-videos, or about 10 of these advanced animated videos with proper lip sync and background audio. Not too bad for what you're getting. Let me know your thoughts on this new VO3 model by Google in the comments below.